Oh, not that. Starman. Stupid zombie. Just standing on top of this thing and zombies looking up at me going. This thing being in here. What thing? Uh, safe point over here going towards the dam. I don't remember this safe point existing. <laughs> Come on, they're saying I can't collect the tomatoes. Bullshit. Zombie. Wish this thing would load the correct arrows. Hey, bear. Yeah, I flew. That's a lot of death poison. There's a blueprint on the table. You help the peacekeepers. Oh, yes, we can get her later. But only to get here, really. Ator. He was trying to do something good in Old Villador. But the hatred between the Bazaar and PK grew too strong. It became a powder keg. And those renegades, why are they after you? Probably the same reason as you. To access the GRE database. What do you want from it, Aiden? Why are you risking so much? I'm looking for my sister. Your sister was in the GRE? She... No, she was a prisoner. I haven't seen her in 15 years. A prisoner? You mean a test subject? I don't know what I'll find. She's... She's the only family I've got. The only answer to what Waltz has done to us. Waltz? He held us there. 
had a hobby of experimenting on kids. Did you know about that? I was only a mid-level doctor, Aiden. I'm sorry. Want to know anything else? Or can we go? Why are you helping me? Are you looking for something in the database as well? Aiden, those vaults contain my organization's biggest secrets. I almost died because I was a part of it. I need to know what they were hiding. What if you don't like what you discover? Nothing ventured, nothing gained. How did a GRE doctor wind up at the bazaar? By not letting anyone know I was a GRE doctor. After the revolution, the GRE were blamed for the disaster. Personnel were rounded up and... executed. People used revenge to relieve the pain. Doesn't matter if it doesn't work. What happened, happened. Now I'm someone else. How are you planning to get us inside the observatory? Look, there's a security tunnel into the complex. It was locked up years ago. Give me the key, Aiden. Are you sure the key is functional? Well, it has been. Maybe the problem is that the building has no electricity. Is there any other way to get in there? It depends how much we're prepared to risk. A lot, if you ask me. Okay. Then come with me. I have something to show you. Well, that's the blueprint. Hammer. I'm, uh... Oh, an artifact. See those domes? Sure, but the place is flooded with chemicals. The GRE had a solution for that. When they created the THV Gen Mod, they had to protect their employees from exposure. But the THV what? The chemicals. They came up with blockers. Shots that would shield their workers for a few minutes from the fumes. Fortunately, I still have two doses. Had a feeling they'd come in handy one day. Oh, those must be worth a pretty penny. They are extremely rare. For now, we will need only one for you. Wait, you're not coming? No, I, I will join you, but first, I'd like you to restore the power to the building. You see, I have panic attacks when I'm in tight spaces or in the dark. Now, you probably think I'm a coward. Not at all. I think it took guts to come here. So let's do this. When you get there, first restore the power. Then I'll be able to join you. Hold out your arm. Remember, the shot shields you from the chemicals for a limited time only. Can't I take the other one too? No, not at the same time. This stuff's too strong. Go as fast as you can to the smaller dome, and from there to the higher one. You should find a door leading inside. There. You'll be safe. Then head to the B block. There you should find the building's main circuit breaker. As soon as you turn on the electricity, the security door will unlock, and I can join you by going through the tunnel I showed you. Now go. The blocker is working. <coughs> the blocker is working. Veronica, I made it through the chemicals to the first dome. 
Great. Now just get to the second one. Find a door, a hatch, or whatever leads underground. Right. Us. Swing, boy, swing. We got loot. <laughs> Look like it slammed you with a door. <laughs> Hey, Veronica, found the entrance. So far, so good. But how do you know this place so well, by the way? I was here just once, long ago. But I have a good memory. That sounds useful. Well, sometimes it's a curse. Really. Really? There were no garbage bags at the bottom. <laughs> You, you didn't even make it to the bottom. You landed on the edge of a pipe. <laughs> Magic. Veronica, I have a horde of infected here. Shit. I hoped it would be empty by now. Well, it isn't. I don't know if I can get through. Use the UV flashlight on your belt. That should keep them at bay. Just don't stop, Aiden. I'm gonna kill them all. Oh, what's this movie? I'm surprised no runners came after us. Oh, there they are. Wait, can we use the rope uh, like swapping? all the loot. I love that sound. Faces on. That was only an arm hit. The water did leak. 
Uh, no, it's not. Ow. That is the. <laughs> That's why you know you use explosives. Apparently, the masses didn't help him. Oh, loot crate over here. I said, die. Go with this one. Hi there, hi there. Oh, a big boy there. Just keep swinging. Yeah, I got mm, freaking stun locked by an a-hole one that jumped across the entire freaking place. Okay. Ah, I almost reached it. Side. God damn it. Yeah. Uh, loot lockers. Damn it, Ma. We hit this thing. Oh. Now the water's deadly. Hey, Veronica, I made it. The electricity's on. Great. The security tunnel is open. I'll try to take the elevator down to you. Yeah, this place was quite the hive. Plenty of infected. But I got rid of them. They were people too, Aiden. They deserve respect. When they're not trying to eat us. Aiden? What? What's going on? The elevator! It stopped! I see. I think it blew a fuse. I'm checking. Do something! Quick! Please! Don't worry. I'll fix it. Come on. Please, don't leave me here. Don't be afraid. I just need a moment. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. What the hell? Oh, what? fuck you, game. Game just chipped me out of loop. 
Like the oh. the case opened and then it closed no, again, opened again with no it. loot. Please, please let me out. <laughs> Bullshit. <laughs> Ah, I'm up. working on it. Just let me out! Let me out! I'm not sitting on my hands here, Veronica. Try to breathe. Slowly. Uh, oh. Not much of a map going Don't leave here. me! Just don't leave me here! Shouting won't do anything except attract infected. Yeah, calm down. I won't leave you. This way? Oh. So we gotta find the power cable and bring it to the number one. Ah, oh, okay. It's probably down here somewhere. Found it. That was quick. Yeah, it was up here. you by the elevators you should have took the stairs why is she taking mm -hmm. the elevator yeah it's like an elevator on power and everything's very iffy or non-existent are you all right see told you everything would work out just get in. No, you always been claustrophobic. Seriously? For over ten years. So what happened then? Aiden, for God's sake, can we not talk about this right now? The, the database. Where is it? Just give me a moment. Below what the us. Hell? Even farther than this? Another six floors hey, down. Oh, come on in. How you doing? This is a pretty high tech. Before the GRE, this complex was run by the military. They used it to monitor threats, rocket attacks, that sort of thing. That's why they called it the observatory. Then the virus came and that was the end. Oh great, my boss broken. You know what's broken? So, what happened here, in the end? That's not well, good. the GRE lost control oh, no, of the situation, goes. and it all went it's to hell. Slaggy. Everything collapsed. From what I know, the scientists at first barricaded themselves inside. But soon, conditions in here were as bad as they were in the city. So, some of them quietly slipped out. And those who stayed are the ones you got rid of earlier. So the military ran this place before the GRE? Yes. It used to be a Cold War command bunker. Cold War? A period in the last century. Wars back then were fought on a grander scale. It wasn't just about day-to-day -day matters like having enough water, UV lamps, and food scraps. 
In a way, though, it was just like things are now. People lived every day in constant fear. That's quite the story. They used to call places like this witnesses to history. Great. Dark again. Wait. I'll try and figure something out. I mean, that's why you carry a flashlight with you. We have electricity you. here. We could use it to power up the whole floor. Loot box. Oh. To the vents. So I guess we have to open a door first. It's a tight fit in here. Other loot box in here. I need to open these doors somehow. Maybe from the other side. Oh, blue. Okay. Yeah. I go through the ceiling. I didn't see that before. I'm like Spider Man over. <laughs> Spider Moon, Spider Moon. depending on what weapon I'm wielding. <laughs> yeah, I'm starting to do the same thing. I got the defender stuff if I'm using the two hand, and then the brawler stuff if I'm using the one hand. Where's that chest I saw? And then I got a kind of mix and match. There it is. It's in there. Veronica, how you holding up? Just want to get to that database and get out of here. You're doing great. Just talk to me. Why are you really helping me? You're taking quite a risk. I promised I'd help you, right? Okay, I get it. Just hold tight. I'll get there as fast as I can. Oh, there you are. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, Just... the loot room. Nasty rags. This way to the loot room. Oh no, this isn't the correct way. The loot room. <laughs> Bitch. 
back in there. This must be the other turn. I got it. This way. What? Deliver him? I thought I came through through a vent. So. Maybe I'm in the wrong spot. I don't know. I thought I saw an opening in a vent, but I didn't. I don't see any uh, other wire. Just a straight shot into that one room. Any pathway up? Maybe it opens up once we do the cable. Funny, we're crawling through these vents, and yet our bodies are bigger than the vents. This is fine. <laughs> I just crouched under it and <laughs> like towering over it. Nah, I think it opens after we do this. Leads into that room. <laughs> Let there be light. Oh, no, this opened up. Okay, we got some extra space here. Bathroom. And upstairs. Ah, there's that vent. Hello. <laughs> Really? It just goes between the two bathrooms. <laughs> uh, that's the biggest troll of them all. Oh, there's a loot box in the one you went in there, though. Says. I don't know we're already in here. Hey, Redix, please. What? I think it opens up when we after we talk to her. 
Smart move. Rerouting the circuit. Yeah. Saved my life a few times. Veronica? Should we get going? Yes. Let's get this over with and then get out of here. This way. Can you walk any slower? Is there. You'll finally know what happened to your sister. She's all I have. What about your parents? I don't remember them. Just her. We... <laughs> we were a good team. Without her, it's like... Uh... God, I don't know. You don't know what? Well... I don't really know who I am. We're all different people than we were 15 years ago. We all got... Lost. Up in the... Yeah, it's, uh, the right place. Same event we already tried twice. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that just takes you in there. It's here. It's locked again. What now? The terminal is inactive. The security system isolated this area. Uh, I guess I'm a bandit. I How you doing? got an idea. Try to find the officer's room. There's a security desk. We could try to operate the door locks from there. You should be able to use your GRE key on it. You sure know a lot about this building. Please, just insert the key and select emergency unlock on the screen. I'll explain everything to you when we're done. Chicken nuggets. I wish I had some chicken nuggets. Me. Think so. Just stay where you are. Oh, okay. Here's the loot one. That's what we're after. Oh, the helmet. So this is how that event works. It's gonna be in that room full of zombies, I just know it. Yep. when I had the axe out. Ooh, my bow. Opens as me. Yeah, what about that? in this refrigerators. What is this? Oh, of course the door's broken here.
Dr. Veronica Ryan, Director, Field Laboratories Department. A mid-level GRE doctor, my ass. Seems to be Veronica's office. You weren't honest with me, Veronica. Who's that boy? Maybe her son? Aiden. A funny thing. Seems there was another Veronica Ryan, director, field labs department. I was going to tell you. Why are you helping me? Are you working with Waltz? Waltz? No, never. Even back then, I didn't. Waltz had his own research team. But you knew about the experiments, how they used kids. <laughs> me and my sister. That's why I'm here, Aiden. I... I cannot forget what we did here. That we let you down. All those kids in pain and no cure to show for it. Cure? We were five, for fuck's sake. Small children showed natural immunity to the virus. We saw a correlation between age, brain development, and infection severity. That's why they were experimenting on you. The GRE, the world, needed you. You seemed our only hope. I'm sorry. Was it worth it? I mean, did you even come close to a cure? We were close. But the virus... It finally reached the complex. So, were you involved in those experiments? No. The tests on children were all performed at a laboratory. Here we were gathering data and compiling research. I was here when it all happened. Team members began to turn, and things quickly spiraled out of control. One by one. We were locked inside, hiding, sneaking around through those dark corridors and ventilation shafts. My son. He was here with me. Paul. He was five back then, too. What happened to him? I managed to find the shaft leading to the main entrance. I told Paul to wait for me. I kissed him. And I told him to wait until I made sure the entrance was safe. He clung to me. Didn't want to let me go. When I came back for him, he was gone. I was only away for 15 minutes. <sighs> I spent the next week looking for him. And then the rest of my life crying. I should have known. He was a kid, scared, alone. I'm sorry. You were trying to take him out of here. How could you know? Anyway, we all have our own stories of the past. Let's concentrate on what happens next. Okay, let's go. Damn, she got back over here fast. So, um, I'm going in. Hope you find what you've been looking for. All the GRE's data is in there, Aiden. What's up? Damn it, I don't know. I'll try it again. It's stuck. 
Fuck it, I'll go. No, wait. I'm done waiting. It's time for answers. What's going on? Talk to me, Veronica. Are you okay? Looks like we tripped an alarm. Decontamination procedure. Decontamination procedure? That can't be good. It's not. Chemical decontamination's deadly. Well, well, how do we stop it? I don't know. Veronica? You were the director Veronica. of the place. How do you not know? Veronica? I can't stop it. Do something. I'm thinking. So think faster. Blockers. I still have one. You have to find one for yourself. Uh, any idea where to look? The control room. Maybe they kept some there. Go. Find the control room. Find a way up. Hurry. Control room. Upstairs. <laughs> Uh. Nice, I had that on. Quick! I know, fucking no! Fuck. Now you got it. I found one. That's it! Alright, now comes the fun part. <laughs> Aiden? Aiden, you all right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I used the blocker. Thank God. I think we're safe now. That's good to hear. Ready to plug in? Are you serious? Yeah, do it. Cross your fingers, Aiden. The moment of truth. Damn, it's broken. Oh no, you shitting me? Yeah, I am. It's just an old system. Wait, give me the key. Authorization granted. Ow. There is a list of patients and personnel. Who do you want to check first? Search for Mia. Is that your sister? Yes. Nothing. Impossible. She was there, with me. <sighs> I'm searching. Sorry, Aiden. Records show no patients named Mia. God! It's impossible. I will check my name, Aiden. Aiden. Uh, there's one record? Among the youngest children, year 2020. Oh, good. Aiden Caldwell? Is that your surname? Well, it is now. What does it say? Data classified. Only one note. Warning. Patient shows an above average tolerance to the substance. Most tests performed. Exemplary results. I think so. Is there anything else? No. That's all. Waltz. Checking. One record. Clinical studies. Substance 1354. Study abandoned. All patients discharged from the center. Look through all the names. Uh, patient discharged. All of them? 
Yes. Damn it. No inform where they ended up. Or about this substance, uh, 1354 or something? I'm sorry, Aiden. There's more. The substance was also tested on some infected at GRE facilities across the city. To no avail. The project was run and supervised from X-13. It was eventually shut down, as was X-13 itself. Is there anything more about this X-13? In here? I doubt it. But I heard about it. X-13 was a hub of GRE operations. And the substance, you know what it is? There were so many tests and clinical studies, Aiden. Let me search the database for the research data. Something's wrong. What do you mean? It says a procedure's been initiated. Another procedure? I'm looking... Lots of data. Started, then paused... 11 years ago. Resumed a few days ago in X-10. There's also a map. <laughs> Several locations are marked, including the observatory. What the hell does it all mean? I have no idea, but... Intruder alert. Intruder alert. In infected? They must be here somewhere. God, the renegades. They must have followed us. There's Apple? no time. <laughs> Hurry, take the key, hide yourself somewhere, and lock yourself in. I'll deal with them. Aiden, we don't know how many there are. I'll handle it. Let me show them. Time to break some necks. Too late for that now. Yeah. Right, bye. <laughs> Veronica, you all right? What was that? As we just walked through but the door. Bad news. These locations on the GRE system, they appear to be targets. Targets for missile strikes. Missile strikes? What are you talking about? The failsafe protocol. We don't have much time. Listen, this marks River End and Garrison. That's in the central loop. People live there. You have to warn Frank. Okay. Okay, I will. If Frank... If Frank, your neighborhood is marked on some tactical map. You have to tell people to evacuate. What? No time to explain. Just clear everyone out of there, Frank. How can I warn them? I got no way to send out an emergency broadcast. I'll try to reach as many as possible. God, shit. Open the fuck up! Why do we not boys haul here. up the peace I'll troopers? I'll try to get them from above and take them out. You're safe here. Oh, that's one hell of a stupid plot hole. Take a long time to open that. <laughs> what? Heard a lot about you. Might say I'm a fan. Oh yeah? You want an autograph?
Veronica, I think it's safe now, but we have to get going. Veronica? Just squeeze through. You constantly squeeze through spaces like this, and you can't do it this time. Really? Veronica? You there? How the hell did you do that? Double jump. I launched myself and hit spacebar again. Went through the door. Yeah, why can't, why there. can't we squeeze through here? Bound. Plot. Plot. Plot failure. Veronica, talk to me. I had to get out, Aiden. I'm sorry. I felt trapped in there. Okay, where are you? I headed towards the elevators. I. Veronica? What's happening? Someone's here, Aiden. Oh, no. No, no, no! Veronica! She was here. No, no, no. Find her. You heard the boss. We're moving. Veronica, talk to me. Hang on, Please. Veronica. I'm coming. Did all this loot just respawn? Looks like it. God damn it, I hate this case. Uh, take one thing out of it and everything else disappears. <laughs> Fuck this case. <laughs> case is bullshit. Let us through, let us through, let us through! I'm stuck in the wall! That was total horseshit. That's bullshit, stupid bug. The door's not opening! <laughs> 